few weeks ago I got a box in this shiny packaging. Now let's see what we have in the packet. So here we got the Rencam 2 4K edition. On the top of the box here we have Rencam branding and on the left side here we have some camera details and there is nothing written on the other sides. Now let's quickly unbox the camera. So first we have Rencam card on which there is some important information and links. Next we have our camera Rencam 2 4K edition. We will talk about it later so let's keep it aside. Now let's open the black box. So here we got the TV out and power cable, USB cable for charging and data transfer, tripod mount adapter and lens hood. And at the end here we get Samsung 128 GB SD card and card reader. So this is all that we got in the box. Now let's talk about the camera. This camera comes with Sony 8 megapixel image sensor and it can record 4K at 30 fps, 2.7K at 60 and 30 fps and full HD at 60 and 120 fps. It comes with 3.7 volt 800 mAh replaceable lithium ion battery. The weight of this camera is only 49 grams. This camera also support live FPV preview with provided TV out cable while recording. You can also connect the camera to flight controller to make it remotely controlled for video recording. On the top of the camera here we have run cam branding and this is the power and shutter button. And the LED around it is power and shutter LED. Next we have Wi-Fi and mode button and it is the Wi-Fi and mode LED. On the front side here we have the camera lens and lens hood. On the left and right side we have holes for buzzer. If we see the back side this is the battery compartment and this is the micro USB slot for power charging and data transfer. At the end here we have the micro SD card slot. Now let's quickly insert the SD card in it. Okay guys, our camera is ready to use. To turn on the camera, just long press the power button. Now our camera is on and the blue LED is indicating that the camera is in video mode. To switch between modes, just long press the Wi-Fi button. Now currently it is in photo mode. Now it is in OSI mode. Now we are back to video mode. To start the recording, just short press the power button. Blue LED is blinking means the camera is recording. To stop the recording, short press the power button. To take the picture in photo mode, just short press the power button. Now we are back to video mode. To turn on the Wi-Fi, just short press the Wi-Fi button. This blue LED blinking means Wi-Fi is on and we can pair it now. To connect it, just open the Wi-Fi setting and click on the name. Then open the Runcam app and click on the connect your camera. Okay, so we are connected. As you can see here, this is the live preview of the camera. By clicking on the red button, you can start and stop the recording. By using this app, you can change the modes, camera settings and video settings. Now guys, let's see some sample photos and videos of this camera. As you can see guys, the quality of this camera is very nice. The buy link of this camera is available in the description. Very soon I will use this camera in my RC hobby projects. So subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for future updates and don't forget to like the video. That is it for today guys. I will see you in the next one.